Hi, thank you for joining me. Uh, we are making a keto version of a traditional Chinese sesame noodle. If you like content like this, please subscribe and share with others. So the Chinese sesame cold noodle is very popular traditional dish that's uh, enjoyed throughout different Chinese regions with um, local takes. Uh, it's one of my favorites growing up in Taiwan. And uh, of course, I'm eating keto now, so I have to tweak um, the dish a little bit to fit my uh, ketogenic lifestyle. I am using shirataki noodle and um, a whole bunch lettuce leaves and cucumber, carrots, eggs, and some scallion. I also cook up some meat, and this is the star of the dish, the sesame sauce. Um, so here I will show, show you how to make the sesame sauce. keto diet um, I like to have a lot of veggie and for the shiataki I actually cook it longer than the instruction I usually cook it for four to five minutes so the uh, texture is more like Chinese noodle which is softer not so much al dente um, and the pork I will also show you how I make my pork sauce I do like to ground my own meat, so this is actually about half pound of um, country ribs that I grounded up myself. Um, I think it's better quality and also the country rib is, all, is quite fatty. It's not as fat as um, pork belly. By the way, you can use any kind of pork. You can use beef as well. Um, it's any meat you want, uh, but I like pork. Uh, it's more of a traditional meat for this dish. Egg sheets or egg wrapper is something that Chinese people eat a lot. So here I'm just showing you quickly how to make one. Um, it's This one didn't turn out perfect, but that's okay. We're going to cut it up anyway. going to assemble our um, plate by the way uh, all the ingredients are in the description box and as well as cooking method so we're um, plating the uh, lettuce at the bottom so we have a nice green base 
Um, I quite enjoy this part. Um, you might think it's gross that I'm assembling with my hands, but I'm just going to eat it <laughs> after this. So uh, it's just my for myself. But for other people, I would use utensil. Um, I tend to like using my hands <laughs> to eat. I think it makes food delicious. Um, and I'm only using half cap uh, package of the noodle. I, I can't use the whole package. It's too much for me. Um, and here I am dousing the sauce onto my noodles. Um, I'm using like four full, full spoon of it. You can use the entire sauce for this dish if you want. Um, I almost use up all of it anyway. Um, because this also serves as a dressing for the salads. Uh, you know, the lettuce and the veggie as well. So uh, don't be shy on using this um, dressing. After all, this this um, sesame sauce is what it's all about. So now we'll play with color, you know, put, put down some cucumber, carrots, and um, the whole egg, and sprinkle some scallion. Oh, well, uh, yeah, we're going to pile up the meat first. Um, I'm using about half the meat. I mean, it's a lot. It's very fatty pork with bacon. So um, half of that bowl is enough for me. And, uh, and, and the entire dish is quite fatty. Uh, sprinkle some scallions. Make it pretty. And more toasted sesame for wonderful sesame flavor. And that's it. That's the dish. Um, I hope you enjoyed uh, making this dish for with me. Um, if you like this dish and give it a try, please uh, let me know how you like it. Please uh, share and subscribe. See you later.